Hello guys and girls and welcome back to a brand new video today For today's match preview is a game between Doncaster Rovers vs Tromming Rovers at the Keep Memory Stadium this coming Tuesday Massive game for Tromming Rovers, can Tromming Rovers get back to winning ways The game that we played against uh, Stockwell County yesterday It wasn't a great result for Tromming Rovers, we didn't play well We didn't create much in the game And obviously to get two goals I think it was just by luck because the way we played we weren't great at all and if we want to be where we want to be which is the playoffs we need to be a lot more better than that because the game yesterday was all shambles it was shambles the team performance was shocking Cogley was woeful yesterday absolutely woeful he needs to step it up a lot more if we want to win a game against Doncaster Rovers this coming Tuesday because at this moment in time Doncaster Rovers aren't doing well at all at this moment and if we don't beat the East it's going to be embarrassing because we beat the East 3-0 a few weeks ago an absolute winning 3-0 at Penn Park and for me we need to step it up massively I thought the team performance was sh crap. Um, I thought Kane Hemmings was lazy yesterday, in my opinion. And obviously the keeper had a howler. Absolute howler yesterday. But I honestly think he was nervous, in my opinion. I think he was nervous. He didn't know what to do. So, if he's going to be playing, he needs to be stepping up massively in the next few weeks. Because we've got some big games coming up. And obviously, the next one is Doncaster Rovers this coming Tuesday, which is going to be a massive game for Tromley Rovers. So, on the 7th of February for Tromley Rovers. So, obviously talking about uh, Doncaster Rovers, their manager is Danny Schofield. Um, obviously, um, he was there when Tromley Rovers beat them 3-0 a few weeks ago. Which was a good result for Tommy. Obviously, they've got some players the likes of um, they've got some new players, and obviously they've got Tom Tom Anderson. I think he's one of their captains. I think, and um, they've got Oro Sean William Sean Williams. I'm sure he used to play for Manchester United when he was young. And um, they've got um, who else? They've got. Charlie Seaman, who did play against Tommy Rose a few weeks ago, I think he was a left back. And um, they've got Luke Molyneux, former Hartlepool player. They've got Tommy Rowe, who is another good player. Harrison Biggins. Um, who else? Who else? They've got quite a few okay players. Ben Close, former Portsmouth player. Um, George Miller. Has been scoring the odd goal now and again. They've got a uh, former, um, I think, um, Kieran Agard's been everywhere. I think he was at Wigan one year, I think. Um, and obviously, yeah, um, Callum Lavery, obviously, I think he was at Oldham. And yeah, for me, I think it's a big game against them. Um, um, Doncaster this week, we need to start picking up points. Tommy Rovers need to start winning games. If hopefully we can get the winning start against Doncaster Rovers. Obviously, with the performance yesterday, I thought it was an absolute shambles. But for me, we need to step it up one more. Big one more, obviously. Because I thought I thought John Turnbull was atrocious yesterday. Honestly, first game I've seen him play that awful yesterday. I thought, what's he doing? What is he absolute doing? Obviously, I, th I think, obviously, if we have a poor defence against a team like Doncaster on Tuesday, I think, I think I'm going to feel sorry for the keeper because he won't know what to do. Because, obviously, he's only a young keeper. I think he's about 23. So, but for me, we need to see, we need to see how they can develop, obviously, against Tramia this one week. Obviously, um, with um, Doncaster, they've only won um, 
They're two games out of three. Obviously, them getting beat by 1-0 by Hartlepool on Saturday. Obviously, their last two wins was against Carlisle and Rochdale winning, winning against Rochdale, winning 4-3. I think the Doncaster Carlisle game was a 2 1 win. So we need to step it up a lot more if Tram Rovers want to win this game. But can I see Tram Rovers nicking it? I can only see Tram nicking it if we play really well. But that's the only thing I can see. If Tram Rovers want to win this game, they have to be on it. But for me, obviously, speaking to other people, Saying, uh, obviously speaking to one of my mates who's a Doncaster fan, he thinks that they're absolute garbage. So, obviously, when you play Tramia, you you probably will get a win. But we need to start stepping up and getting a win sometime soon rather than later. We need a win on Tuesday massively. People are saying uh, we're out of the top seven. Not a chance. You never say never because we're only six points away from the playoffs. Only we start we having a good run of form from now. You never know. Uh, people are like thinking we're not going to do it. You never know. It's not finished till May, so you got to give the players a chance. I know we have not been great in the, in the last few weeks. But we need to start stepping up a lot more. So yeah, that is my thoughts on that. So my team news, I'm gonna have to say, I'm gonna say, Joe Murphy in goal for me. I'm gonna have has to be Cogley, Bristow on the left, um, Turnbull and Davis. For me. From the left, I'm going to go Logan Chalmers. I think he needs to get a start with Rory Hendry and um, with Leo Connor. And the right, if that, um, if I, I'm going to say Kim Morris because Kim Morris did score yesterday against Stockport, I didn't really see much of him. I thought he wasn't great either. But for me, yeah. Um, strikers. I'm going to have a big change on this. I'm going to say Saunders. And. Jay Burton. And I think Tram Rose can get. A, I think Tram Rose can get a win. In this game. If we play this sort of team. I'm going to say a 1-0 win for Tram Rovers. A goal scorer. I'm going to go Jake Byrne. So that is my score prediction. And then my final thoughts. So hopefully you guys enjoy this video. So please like and subscribe. And I will see you guys at the Keep Moat Stadium. This from Tuesday. Can try and get back to win ways. Let's hope and let's just try and find out. So come on you boys. All the lights. Super on me. And I'll see you guys in a bit. All the lights. Like and subscribe. I like Duncan's YouTube channel. It's brilliant.